Okay, so we are here on day 10. Um, get to, and we're going to candle the eggs now. Um, you can take the lid off, disconnect it. You can be take your time. You don't have to be in a hurry at all. Um, so I prefer using the, the candling torch that comes with the machine. And you can clearly see there is a dark mass there. So we know this is fertile. If we tilt the egg a little bit, you can see the egg sack at the bottom. Okay, so that one's fertile. Moving over to another one. Oh, there we can see the veins. So that was a nice shot just before it turned. So you can see the veins, you can see can see there's some movement in the egg so we've got a healthy embryo there um, oh this is a this is an infertile egg you can clearly see there's nothing going on inside there um, so we can just put that to the side okay so this is a nice example of the egg sac it's normally at the fat end of the egg not the pointy end you can see there's a clear line so uh, um, that as the incubation process proceeds, the air sac will get bigger and bigger. Um, but yeah, you can clearly see it. Oh, a nice big air sac. But you see, there's a little bit of movement there. So there, that's a live chick in there. So that looks good. So we're putting the eggs aside now as we candle. Of course, we want to remove the rollers. Again, another... Nice egg sac. You can clearly see there's something going on in that egg. It's nice and fertile. Looking good. Another one. You can clearly see the egg sac. It's grown significantly from the first candle. 